Pasar. <laughs> you meant a lot to me. Two parents left with so many questions after their son's body was found Sunday in the Schuylkill River near Spring Garden Street in Philadelphia. 21-year-old Asar Scott Thomas has been missing since March 7th until a passerby found his body in the water. I had to go to the funeral place to see that boy, man. <sighs> boy, but that was hard. According to police, there were no signs of trauma to his body. So what happened to Asar? The parents tell NBC10 their son was with his friend Quadir Diaz and another man who they don't know when he went missing. The car the three were in reportedly broke down along Lincoln Drive around 2 in the morning on March 7th. That would be the last report of Quadir and Asar alive. The third man is still alive. We reached out to police about their investigation into the men's disappearance, but they have not released any new information since Asar's body was found or said a foul play was involved. It's hard to believe that he just drowned. It doesn't make sense. I, I want to believe that that's it for closure, but it just it doesn't make sense. The families of the missing men searched for days. First responders also searching in the Wissahickon Creek near where the two men were last reportedly seen. I'm going to search for my son high and low. I'm not going to stop until I find him. Day and night, rain, sleet, snow, I'm not going to stop. It don't matter how long it takes. Go down, don't lie. These are the times Asar's family would like to remember. Just full of energy, just bouncing everywhere. Um, goofy. He liked to have fun. Um, loved family, loved being around family. The 2017 Newman Goretti graduate was currently enrolled in Thaddeus Stevens College, going to school for electrical engineering, according to his parents. Now his parents looking for answers as to how and why their only son's life came to a tragic end. Johnny Archer, NBC 10 News.